Out of the outpouring of the excesses of the beautiful city for what is to be their biggest test of the season from their biggest opponents in their history. Cross into the area is good. Aluku, and it's the first touch of the goal. Junior Lokota. Back to back home goals for Sporting Lagos. Counter attack here for Sporting Lagos. A Saturday Rock Horn. Can he put an icing on the cake? And it's a goal! Sadiq Ismail, ball into the box! That was sticking into the bottom corner! Near side, here it comes down. A decent ball to the poor alter goalkeeper, Paris, that one out. Down beautifully, and Nemina takes it out. It's a goal! can run his face. Jonathan Alugu! Second goal, Sports Lagos. The Bobby boy makes it four goals in his last five games for Sports Lagos. Takes the cross into the box there. And Alma Hedda. You're welcome back to the program. It's Sports Business on Plus TV Africa. I'm Olufuor Ezaga. Now, if you missed the last two or three minutes, um, I'd recommend that you, you probably go to my, my Twitter page, my Twitter handle or X handle, at Olufuor, O-R-U-F-U-O, -U to watch that again. You know, it's a brilliant piece of, of um, te um, tech gaming, uh, you know, on the Nigerian Premier League, highlights of the Nigerian Premier Football League, the MPFL. And I, 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 when I saw that, I thought, you know, this has really humongous potential to blow up our football, not just with, with you know, Nigerians in Nigeria, but football fans around the world, you know. So the guy that did this, um, video or this video game app. The founder, a Covenant University is a graduate. Um, his name is Victor Jedidiah Danian. And um, you know, from what you, ha what you saw, or, or you, you, you can tell that that was really exciting. I saw it first on, on, on Twitter and you know, people loved it. The comments were very, 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 um, very, very, uh, um, how do I put it, positive. Now, oftentimes people ask me, when I talk about sports business having a local base, they ask me, you know, how do we get in on the game? How do we, how do we uh, make money from sports? This is one great example. Uh, you know, this is one tech example. This is, if you play in the tech space, this should excite you. This is how, you know, um, young tech players in Nigeria can get, can get into sports and make it, make it um, really big for themselves as well as for the game. Joining me in the studio is Victor, yeah? He is, like I said, a graduate of Covenant University. And guess what? He's from Kirby State, yeah? So when, when most of you hear about these things, you automatically, automatically think this is from a Southern product, you know, graduate or, or the, but he's, he's nothing, he's from Kirby State. And I thought that was really exciting to point out when you told me about it, all right? So Victor. Nice tape that, that we, we have just seen, you know. How far, how far, are you in the, how far have you gone in the development of this, of this um, product? Okay, so um, thank you very much for having me today. So, so far, we have been able to develop, um, like you, you've seen, the MPFL and the NNL. Mm. Okay, and as we have done that, the, M, the NPFL and the NNL have been the like the foundation of our project, mm. all right? So, and we'll be able to go to some of the other African clubs because of how wide we are making this game to be so that everyone can enjoy even playing um, the MPFL. You know, after the MPFL, there's the continental football. Mm. And in the continental football, you also play against other clubs mm. in Africa. So that's 
what we have done so far, and we have done with the major African clubs, but Nigeria is um, complete. So, so Nigeria is complete. So yes. people can play the game now. Yes. How do they play the game? Okay. So on our website, if you go on our website, um, www.vixenvirtual.com, mm. that's Vixen Virtual, V I K S W E N, and um, Virtual.com. You see the download button there. You just see everything. So it works for PC for now. And we are developing, um, we are looking to develop more platforms, and also especially the mobile version. Okay, what has the response been so far? Uh, so far, it, the response has been very great. It beats my expectations because... I, I can imagine. It's yeah, a brilliant uh, product. Yeah, thank you. So I actually thought that nobody was going to like this. I thought mm. I was wasting my time, okay, just doing it. Uh, why, why would you think that? Uh, because of what we hear about the Nigeria um, League and all. But I was curious about the Nigeria League. I did not know anything about the Nigeria League. So I started building this so that other people and younger people can know. They won't, uh, they won't be ignorant as, like, as I came. To, I knew about the Nigeria League after graduating in the university, like two years after graduating. So, and I don't want people to go through this. I want people to know. And we look for exciting ways. One thing I noticed about the MPF is that most people complain without mm. doing anything. Yeah, yeah. And they go and support the English clubs. Yeah. They, when anything happens in the MPF, they will complain first. Yeah, yeah. After they complain, they won't do anything. So instead of complaining, just play your part. That's yeah. what I, I, I look at. Just, well, I just want to play my part, part in the MPF. That, that's brilliant. And I so hope you, you succeed with this thing. Yeah? Because, yes. you know, um, like I said, this is really um, engaging stuff. Do you have... I'm sure you're looking for sort of some sort of investment. Yes, you? definitely. We're looking for investment for our mobile version because that is okay. our that is our end game. We want to have the mobile app so that the MPFL, the Nigerian football, and more can be in the hands of every Nigerian young player. You know, um, every Nigerian football lover. Mm -hmm. and that's what I can say. If an investor is watching us now, you know, and, and they want to invest, you know, why 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 would you tell them to invest? You know. Yes, this is a this is a big step for the Nigerian football. Okay, mm -hmm. this has never been done before in anywhere in Africa, and this is a way to actually improve our football and also um, push on to the next step in Nigerian football in development. Also, the gaming industry is a multi-billion-dollar industry, mm -hmm. and the African football. Once we can tap into the gaming industry and merge it with the African football industry, that is quite a lot. Mm -hmm. We are a lot of people that. Um, that love football. So now imagine taking this to the north. You know how Kanu Pillars, they have mm, the fans, mm, they come mm. to the stadium, Katina United and all. Imagine they can play it on their phone. Mm. Imagine how many of those fans will just open the phone to see. You know, they only see their stars on the field every week they come. Some might not be able to make it, but you can play and have a feel of even managing Katina United and the more. Nigerians that are yeah. young across this country are over 120, 50, about 120, 30 million people. Yes. It's a huge it's market. It's a huge market right? and so, it's untapped. Yeah, it's, it's, untapped. it's untapped. I hear you do other things beyond just the... You were telling me about the... Yeah, the Fantasy League and all. Yes, yes. So, so Vixen Virtual actually is... Not, we're not just doing only this game. We want to create... Um, we want to promote the NPFL and Af mm. African football. Or, in various ways okay mm. so we've come up with a fantasy league mm. and we're, and also a prediction league we, we know how the fantasy league is that you pick players that's one of our developments you mm. pick players i mean in the mm. mpfl and choose among the players to represent you but the one we have started working on and has been live is the prediction league okay so that's one everybody every player that is playing has a, like wager points okay everybody has like hundred thousand to play mm. and you have to now stake between if a club will win, which of the clubs will win, the outcome of the match, win, home to win, away to win or draw. So why we are doing this is to, because we have always been hearing that the MPFL is too predictable. Mm. And if you watch the MPFL and follow the MPFL, you know that that's not true. Mm. Because you can really not really predict what is happening. People that play these games, they know, people that have been playing, they know how it has been. So and let me see if what you said to me was right. You can, you don't need to play this with real money yes but you win real you, money you win real money and thanks to our sponsors because it was mm. brought to us by our sponsors near pace they are mm. a tech um, fintech company mm. so they saw and they also believe in the nigerian football and they have the nigerian football and they want to do their own part too so we partnered with them so they provided um it's just like put your money where your mouth is mm. in the nigerian football if you can predict mm. where if you can predict the, the outcomes, mm. you will get an amount of money. So you play for free, 
Yeah. You spend virtual money, but you earn real money. Real money. So it's a win-win win case. Victor, I, I have to apologize to you. I'm really, really sorry that we took longer than we should have you know, because okay, we now have to round up the program okay you know what i can guarantee you is we we we're going to do as much as we can to push this because it's, a, it's actually a very brilliant uh, product just quickly say how you can be reached um out, outside of outside of how can if somebody is interested in reaching you what do they do okay so you can reach us through our social media platforms twitter that's x platform, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, all is Vixen underscore virtual. V-I-K-S-W-E-N underscore virtual. Then on my phone number, in case the people want to reach me, it's um, 081-59-647423. So I think that, that yeah. is how and so, reach me. Uh, um, viewers, you have seen, you saw the, the brilliant job that the guy did, you saw the edits. And we're going to try and bring him back on the program so that he can, he can talk more about this product and, um, you know, hopefully get his message across to the team fans, young fans that we have across Nigeria and the African continent. We also heard about basketball and the potential of, of basketball as an economic driver and a, as a social cultural um, builder in, in, in Nigeria, all right? We're going to be back again next week with another bumper package. And um, I would implore you guys to, to keep listening, to keep watching the program, because there's a lot you're going to be hearing about sports business that can open up an opportunity or two for you or your organization going forward. Until we meet again next week, this is me, Urufo Izaga, saying be productive, be good, and stay safe.